here guys I just arrived in Istanbul here guys and uh, it's look unreal for me that I'm here that I'm gonna do what I'm going to do because it's something that I really wish to do for years and I'm gonna do today and not today yeah oh my god I just arrived today yeah and uh, everything's gonna be fine I believe in God and everything's gonna be fine this is the hotel where I am, yeah? The hotel, I just arrived here. And uh, it's a mosque down there. Was my dream. Oh my God, ready? Let's can see the mosque. Was my dream one day to listen when they pray. And I'm gonna, my dream is gonna come true today. Yes, because I'm gonna listen to them when they're gonna pray. This is amazing. Wow, God is good. It was raining, now it's top here. And I'm looking for something for me to eat. I don't know what I'm going to eat, but I'm hungry. I need to eat something now. I cannot gonna eat nothing late and midnight I cannot have nothing, yeah? That's what he said. So I am gonna eat something now. guys I just woke up here and uh, they said they're gonna come to pick me up at uh, 7 7 30 yes it's 7 now I'm gonna have a quick shower and get ready yeah this is me my body here. this is my body yeah and this is my chest my breast yeah you guys can see my breast the window is open here yeah? i'm scared if someone's gonna see me but this is my breast yeah Like I said, you guys, I don't gonna. My bum is gonna be the same, yeah. Even I'm gonna take this for you guys to see. Yeah. This is my reality. This is the hospital, yeah? This, um, this is going to be my room. The reception is down there. Mm -hmm. And this is going to be my room, yeah? Okay, it's not bad. Not bad at all. Yeah. Okay. And this is Olena. This is my bag. Yeah. Everything on God's hand. They just came now here. They take the blood and everything. They done the blood test. I'm gonna do the blood test, then I'm gonna do the more exams here. Yeah. So far, so good, everything. So far, so good. Yeah. 
I remove my thing that I have here that I cannot remove, but God is in control of everything, yeah? And yes. Gonna glue it on here. Waiting. Then bring me just here to the MRI on my chest here to check if, if everything's okay. Yeah. And I'm here. Sit down. Wheelchair. Sorry. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm here on the bed waiting for them to come to pick me up for the surgery, yeah? But like you guys saw, all my body is with the, the, the design, yeah, I can see that. I was so scared when I was coming here. Yeah, I don't want to lie to you guys because when the men go to pick me up from the airport and I see another man on the car, I said, oh my God, they're going to go, they're going to kill me. And the Benny was say to me now that when I go inside the car, I was with so nervous. I was like, not to the good face. Of course, I was not here. I was really scared. I don't gonna lie to you guys at all. When I came to the hospital, I still was like in panic because it, the men appeared. I was like, oh my God, he left me here. He don't gonna come. <laughs> yeah. But then he came, he came upstairs. They give the registration. They done all the exams. Um, they took the blood, the blood. I go to do exam on my MRI, everything, yeah, guys. And uh, now I'm a little bit more calm. And I see the doctors came, two doctors here, and they have photographer here. And uh, yeah, I feel more calm now, yeah. And everything's gonna be fine. I believe I'm gonna wake up in half an They said it's gonna take like five, five to six hours, the operation. I believe when it's finished, I'm gonna be new in Lena. New Elena, new body. Yes. Everything's gonna be fine. I'm feeling much calm now. Everything's gonna be fine. In God's name, yeah. And yes, see you guys with a new body. Bye. Hi, Danny, guys. Hi, Danny. This is a couple hours, or I believe four hours or six hours after my surgery. I'm swollen like a hell. I'm so long and uh, I was very thirsty. They said, not now, not now, not now. Five hours, well, four hours passed, they gave me some water and some soup here and I'm fine. Yes, look like I have any boobs. Any boobs? Yes. See you guys. Look like I have big boobs. Double V swollen. I saw yesterday she came to to check. And I saw that the tattoo that I have for years that I didn't like it. It's gone. It's gone. Yeah, today is the second day on the hospital, yeah. And so far so good, everything's fine. Yeah, they take care of me very well all the nurses and everything. Yeah, I'm happy. Yeah. Second day in the hospital. Done the operation yesterday. And now I need to walk, yeah. Okay. Thank you, Dan. They bring some food. Eat. I'm just gonna eat the soup. I don't know how I'm gonna eat by myself here, but they are very good. They help me a lot. Day three at the hospital. I just have a shower. The nurse they came here. They helped me. The nurse they helped me to have a shower. And uh, yes. I'm here, I don't gonna show you guys now, but I'm very happy with the result. And I have received blood, because yesterday I received blood, today again, 
because I'm anemic. Yeah, this is why. And I'm tired. My dear friends, if someone gonna like you guys and say, come, it's easy. It's not easy. Like nothing in this life is easier. It's boring. Beautiful room. I cannot watch TV because I don't I'm not in a mood. Tired. I feel like when I talk, I feel like I cannot breathe properly. The body is beautiful, but the pain is here, is here too, yeah? I, I hate that they put this here, the medicine. I get the medicine from here. Yes. Ah, oh dear. The weather is so good. Sunny. Oh God, I had a shower, but I'm sweating. I smell, oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm doing this because I want, not because of you, 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 because I want. When I see the boobs for the first time, you guys need to see my face. Wow, wow. I wish to do this new time. Now finally I done. Guys, day four at the hospital. I need to work with this. This is stuck on my my twin. Yes. And what can I say to you guys? Four days in the hospital and in too much pain. I mean pain. Now that you are, I'm open here, yeah? like you guys know. Now I want to cough. Cough with the belly like this. Cough, guys. Oh la la. Sneeze. Like, like someone's stabbing. It's terrible. What can I say to you guys? I do, I, I done this because I was not feeling comfortable with my body the way it was. If you have a nice body, you don't have kids. You, you have a nice body. If you would just want to put your bum bigger or boobs bigger, don't do it. Wait, because you wanna put on weight and the boobs wanna go and you can work out. Because what can I say to you guys? The pain, I have a painkiller. Yes, I have, there's a painkiller here. And uh, when the pain, the pain, this go, feel too much pain. I need to call the girl, man. No, I need to speak with her. Ah, this is finished and this is blood here. She don't see this? Yes, I'm calling her now because I wasn't well. Yes, I believe the pain is finished. And this blood here. Thank you so much. The, the control. Okay. Oh. Yeah. If you don't, if you cannot, don't do it. Because it's too painful. Yeah. This is very painful. It's not. It's not a joke. Who can walk around with this? It's a nightmare. Yeah. You wanna give more pain, Clara? No. no. Look what I received from my friend. He came to see me. And if he bought me this and that. Mm. I come to lose weight, I'm gonna be fat because of him. Mm, my God. Look at this. He's there. Guys, the foods, the food at the hospital, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Yesterday they gave me rice with, uh, I forgot, with the uh, aubergine. Today is the broccoli and the pasta, spaghetti. Oh la la, and they gave me soup. 
good that I have my friend that bring me fruits for me to eat because uh, no good food at all. What is this? Ugh. Guys, walk all day with this and these two bottle is too much. Ah, too, they are too heavy. Ah, it's too much. This is so, sometimes I forgot that I have this and I pull this, it hurt me so much because this is stuck. Okay, bye guys. Hey guys, day five at the hospital. I'm gonna be discharged today. I'm going to go to the hotel today. And what can I say to you guys? I'm walking, I do everything for myself. What I done here? I done just my boobs, lipo on my belly, and um, abdomen, abdominoplasty. <laughs> me to say this name is complicated. Abdominoplasty, abdominoplasty, or something like this, yeah. Uh, tummy, tummy tuck on my belly, yeah. And it's difficult for me to walk. Yeah, it's very difficult. Let me see for me to show you that I'm like this uh, and I cannot walk properly and because I lay down like all day and I feel like my I'm losing my bum yeah because it's square now it's like this bah! and I didn't done my bum no no I didn't done because the thing that I didn't like on my body was just my my boobs and my belly yeah but uh, thank god i'm so happy with the result so happy you guys don't imagine i cried yesterday on the phone with my daughter yeah i said everyone know the way i didn't like it, my boobs the way it was everyone know and she said mom i know and she said mom you're gonna make me cry as well and i was crying i had one friend that to bring me fruits and the fruits he bring me goodies here every single day. He's one friend that uh, I met on social media. Yeah, talk with me. He don't talk. He just put the heart and everything. He was he is from Istanbul. He go one time to London, and he go to London and said, "Helen, I want to see you." I said, "Oh my God, this man he want to see me." And I spoke with my daughters. Yeah, and I said, "I believe this man have the same problem as your daddy." Because it under operation, I see on his belly, he have like he have a story. Yeah, I need to put this down. Oh God, painful. Oh. I need to show you guys my bum here yeah? a little bit here. Yeah? Not that much. Yeah, and uh, I didn't go to see the man. I said one day I'm gonna come to Istanbul. I'm gonna I'm gonna see you. And I came to Istanbul. And I said to him that I'm in Istanbul. And he came when I done the operation to see me, he came with his daughter to see me. And next day he came again with, with another daughter. And the old every single day he come, he brings something for me. This is amazing. Yeah. I hate to work with this. They said they're gonna remove this today. And I'm so scared because I see disease around my belly. And uh, uh, when they put a cream on my belly, and you see like they pass on top of this. Oh my God, this is gonna be, I believe it's gonna be painful today. Like I said to you guys, if you don't have any, you have a small boobs, it's okay. It's okay. If it, my boobs was like big and it was back, back, and I was not happy. I'm so far like this, because I want to feel comfortable with my body. If you have a beautiful body, don't waste, don't do it. Stay where you are. I swear down because it's too painful. Hmm. Since yesterday, they don't give me more like pain, pain. If I have any, if I want, I mean pain, I need to ask for 
like for pain painkiller for her, for them to give it to me yeah yeah oh i'm gonna show you guys and they have it in the toilet there wait a second i'm gonna show you guys what i have in the toilet but this is the silicone that they put it i never want a wish to put a silicone but i put it yeah and this is this is a silicone we put is 350 cc you guys can see 350 yes then she's with the silicone and my boobs is so beautiful 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 yes i'm gonna show you guys what they remove from me is on the toilet here but i didn't open because i don't want to see I don't want to see, I'm gonna show you guys. Ah. The, the room is, is massive. See, if I bring someone, people can sleep here, have a tea. I will just have a breakfast down there. Yeah, this is all my room. Have a toilet for the guests as well. Yes, they took it again, very good of me. This is my old job, have my stuff here. My bag and my, my jacket. Mm, I hope it smells so good. It smells like my perfume. But I don't smell good at all. This is the left there. What they removed from me. But I don't want to see. I'm fine. I don't want to see. Yeah, I'm tired. Oof. Yes, I do everything by myself here. Yeah? It's better. I walk, I walk, I do everything. Today the weather is bad. But yeah. Oh. Yes, guys. Day five in Istanbul. I need to work with this because this is stuck here. And about my boobs. Look at this. Just check this. Oh, look, it's up, beautiful, beautiful. Let me see if I'm where I can show you, I'll show you guys a little bit. I'm all, all swollen, yeah, guys? Oh, God, you guys cannot see. And I cannot open this. For me to put this up now. Oh, la la. Why did I open this? Ah. Okay, done. Okay, guys, speak to you guys when I'm gonna be on the hotel, okay? And uh, I didn't done the lipo on my arm, I really wish. They said the packet that I, I order is not include the lipo all around my body. I said, but I don't mind. Doctor came to say, no, 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 you're fine. I said, but I know if I'm not, I'm not fine, okay? Just leave it. I didn't done the light. I'm going to do my exercise. I'm going to lose what weren't, what put me like I'm no, I was not having my body, was just my boobs and my belly. The rest, I, it's okay. I can do some exercise and lose my arm and uh, my legs. Yeah. The rest, I'm fine. Bye, guys. Guys, this is a true story, eh? Reality. What's happened? I came to, to do my surgery by myself. I didn't bring anyone. Now they discharge, discharge me. I'm at the hotel, hotel now and I need help. I want to lay down on the bed. I go and ask for more pillows. I have four pillows now and I cannot lay down. I'm struggling to lay down on the bed. I'm in so much pain. I put these trousers there because I have one friend that they want to come to see me. I don't want him to see me with the, with the pajamas. And the God. Oh, how I'm gonna. Goodness me. Ah, oh, I thought that I prepared this properly. Ah, oh, it's not.
you know, do this to yourself, come by yourself. I feel that they're gonna have someone that's gonna help me here, but they don't. How I'm gonna lay down properly because I'm in pain like this. My God. Oh my goodness me. Oh God. No. What I'm going to do. Merda, caralho. Ah. Oh. Oh. I'm going to put the phone there. Me to try to see if it's more easy. Oh, God. It's going to go like this for you guys to see that. Don't do what I done, eh? Ah, oh, for us. Oh, my Deus. Now it's too high. I need one pillow here. Now it's too high. Oh, Jesus Christ. comfortable now. I'm scared to lay down. Oh God. Oh, it's not good. But it's okay. Everything God's hand. Everything's fine. Everything will be fine. I believe in God. Guys, lay down in this bed is a nightmare. And I'm walking just some exercise. Yeah, so I'm walking. I walk already like five times. I'm gonna walk more. Yeah. I'm gonna fold this. Okay. Today is Monday. I'm gonna back go back to London Wednesday. And uh, my only problem is to be on the room by myself. But everything's gonna be fine. Guys, it's five o'clock in the morning. I cannot sleep. I sleep like this. I'm gonna say to you guys, I don't know. I wish for this pain to go away. I sleep with this because it's easy for me to hold, little for me to come out of the bed. I'm in so much pain, so much pain you guys don't imagine. I don't know, I believe if they put this a little bit too tight, I want to fix this, but uh, it's, it's too much. I'm in so much pain you guys don't imagine. I'm like a prayer for this pain to go away 
me to feel good again. Like I said, you guys, don't think that it's easy. The pain is terrible. The pain is terrible. Just that I can, I can see it, you guys. The pain is terrible. You guys would know what's up with me. I just go, I wash myself, and uh, I go downstairs to the hotel for, and I ask the, the man, um, the pharmacy, where is the pharmacy? If they have any restaurant around, explain to me where is the restaurant. And I, wa I was going to, to go to get my food for me to eat here. It's lunchtime. Uh, breakfast, I only eat an apple. Then came one gentleman came to speak with me. He said, you done operation. You cannot go. The hotel, they have like um, someone like to help uh, in case like you done operation and you cannot walk too much. They're going to now. They're going to go to the pharmacy to buy some bandage for me that I need and the food for me. I want to eat a steak. Since yesterday, I want to eat a steak with the chips. And the manager's gonna go now to buy some 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 steak for me and chips. This is what I want. He said, "You know, Jewish? No, I'm not a Jewish person. Jewish? No, 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 no. My friend needs a lot of juice. He's there. I don't wanna drink because I'm not a, like a freezy drinks. All of these Coca Cola, Fanta, Pepsi. No, 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 no. Only one freezy freezy drink that I drink is a uh, Guarana. This is the only one." Yeah.